Hello and welcome back to Factorio. So we are building our second iron production line so that we can get a lot more iron so we can go and split off our iron gear production into its own separate section and just make uh, a ton of iron gears basically because iron gears I believe only make out of iron which makes them perfect for their own kind of production line. The reason we're up here however is so we can pick up all of this. So we just need a lot of transport belts and uh, inserters. We're also going to come down here and we're going to grab a whole bunch of copper and iron gear wheels. The reason we're doing that is because um, iron gear wheels are used in a lot of production things and copper is as well. Just so we have a large amount of uh, raw materials if we need them. Right. This should all start to do something soon. It's not the most efficient thing in the world, but like we've got one line fully done. Which I think is a good start. Like, um, when it's not filling up both of these, I'll care. Although it looks like the left hand side's not filling up quite as much as it needs to. Weird. Anyway, we, we can fix that. We can actually put in faster um, belts and that will actually fix a lot of our problems here. Uh, the reason I went up there to get... Oh, I actually didn't need all those inserters, but that's fine. I went up there to get inserters, so now we can go... Oh, probably that's a little overkill. So we'll go one, there we go, something like, I like them to be neat. I know it's the, there's like a better optimal pattern I was trying to remember there, but you know what? I prefer them to be neat. I don't care if it's optimal to do them in a different way. If, the, if it looks neater doing them this way, that's the way it's going to get done. Right, there we go. See, that's the problem with me and Factorio. I'm like, I want it to all look neat. And then the optimal ways to like bodge it a little bit a lot of the time which is fine or like to make it look a little bit worse but it's it's like actually the production is a little bit quicker and i'm like oh but it could look so much nicer i don't know maybe it's too many years of uh looking at border gore and crusader kings and trying to fix it it's like it's gotta look neat gotta look neat right Ooh, down here over here right on this side. Make sure they're nice and even. I think these are meant to be like separated like separated by one or something like that. Like you're meant to have these on the opposite sides, like on diagonals. I don't know. I, I saw the diagram. I just didn't I think I saw a diagram for that. But I just you know. I, I don't remember it. Do I have these the right way around? Yeah, I have those the right way around. That's fine. Uh, I could believe that I had them the wrong way around. Right. Uh, oh, we need to build a whole bunch of... I don't have any wood. Oh, no, I have I have some, I guess. Electrical poles, because we lost all of our electrical poles earlier. Uh, I'm just going to set it building... It'd be nice if there was, like, build max. Oh, there is. You can just shift click. I was like, what if you can just shift click and build max? Yeah, that'll work. Okay. There we go. Get that all nice and built. Put those down, swap them out for uh, this one, and we can just stick these in. Oh, we now need, we can research concrete. Nice. Um, I think what I'm going to do, instead of doing what I'm doing there, I'm, uh, never mind, we're never getting that, we're never getting that medium pole. That's fine. Um, can I go over here? No. So I could do these three with one. It's not bad. Then go... I can't do the other side anyway, so I might as well just do it like here. Do those three of one. Yeah, that's probably the best way of going about this. There we go. That looks nice and neat. Then on this side... Um, we're just going to have to do four at a time on, on this side. That's fine. Uh, yep. Get these going. For a time, for a time, for a time. Bottom two. And then we'll do three on this side. There we go. Nice and uh, simple. It's all working now. Look at that. We have another iron production line going well. Oh, although, why is it all going on the right hand Why is it all going on the left hand side? Why is none of it going on the right hand side? Weird. Weird. 
Okay. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, and all of that's all going to one side as well. That's a little bit not optimal, I would say. Hmm. So, but I, I guess it's all going to one side because there isn't enough to handle both streams here. Okay. Let's go get ourselves some fast transport belts. Uh, let's get all of them. Let's start making this faster. So, we probably also want a fast splitter as well. We could. I cancel a couple of those. Can we make... Yeah, we can make um, one fast splitter. Is that all we need? Oh, well, we should probably make two. At the very least. And then we're just going to replace like this splitter with our fast splitter. You know what? Let's just uh, get rid of those for just now. Right. Uh, two fast splitters. Wow, it's got to build all the individual parts. Ah, okay, fine. Uh, I'll just build the second one like this because we already have the splitter. That'll save us a little bit of time. We're getting attacked somewhere. Uh, looks fine to me. Looks like it survived. Doesn't look healthy, but it looks like it survived. Right. Down here. We can now go fast splitter. Perfect. Uh, how do I get camera? How do I get the... There we go. I was on like a weird camera thing there. It's very weird. Anyway, destroy that one. Place it with this one. That's going to be a lot quicker. Right. So that will help out a little bit to start with. Then we're going to want what's coming into here to be quicker. So we're going to get a bunch of that. We're just going to go in like this. So that'll now get to our fast splitter and split quicker. Okay. Uh, but what we want to do is we want to get a lot more of that. So grab all of those. Uh, I'm going to go grab iron gear wheels because it looks like we need those to build what we're building. So let's do that. Iron gear wheels. Let's head up this way. Just want the iron gear wheels if that's okay. Also, should probably grab some of these while we're at it. There we go. The more transport belts. Right. Then, what else does it need? Transport belts, iron gear wheel. Okay, that seems fine. Uh, and we're just going to start from like down here and just start moving along. Nice if there was just like a replace function. So like if I was able to just place this down and say I just want to move it from here. Oh, it's, it's building all the iron gear wheels first. It's a little annoying. Anyway. Uh, why do I need that? Oh, because otherwise it will go around the corner and then... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fine, I guess. It's fine. Right, uh, iron gear wheel. You know what? Stop building those for a little bit. We'll build this what we're looking for. That's fine. Build the... So I can... Oh, I can build over the top. Just as I was saying, it'd be nice to build over the top. And it's just an option. Uh... Given that one's just there to change how things go, I don't think I need to up... Don't think I need to upgrade it. This is neat. I like this. The ability to upgrade... Oh. To upgrade these. Just need to remember the ones at the end are... Uh, that way around. Look at that. That going a little bit quicker is going to allow these to be fed a little bit more from the other lanes, I think. It just is getting slowed down here. It's alright. We can wait. We can wait. We'll get there eventually. There we go. Now we're making them. I'm going to put them in there. This one's going down the way. Right, over this way. Uh, place these down. Find the spot where we left off. Okay. Oh, now we're building more iron gear wheels. Okay, but I'm basically thinking if we have all of this going quicker down here, hopefully that means that we'll be able to, you know, serve the two lanes at once. Although what I should do as well is I should have this going somewhere else, but I don't have that going anywhere else right now. So that's going to... Slow things down a little bit. Um, 
yeah, where do I want this to go when it's done? Kinda want it to go out of here. So I wanna just have our iron gear production right there and then just have it go like round under the copper and then just, I'm trying to think how we feed it back in. Yeah, we could have one lock kind of making its way along this way and up to, to where the old iron gear production is. I guess that kind of works. Yeah. So we'll just make that production line there because it, it, it's only like one line. So that's why it's a little bit easier. Um, right, where do I want to upgrade this? So starting here. Like that. Nice. Uh, I need more. Wow, I'm actually out. Okay, that's fine. We can head up this way. I like how it goes around the corner and just speeds up. It's like, wee, and it just hits nothing. Oh, that's because we have one transport belt in there. So it just slows right down there on that one transport belt, then speeds right up again. Okay, uh, grab a bunch of iron, grab a bunch of copper, grab a bunch of gears. Grab some more gears. Grab some more transport belts and inserters, I guess, because they're also there. Right, grab that, grab that. Head over this way. Grab the gears. Right. So, we're after more of these. Uh, grab more gears. Don't know why it's not using the gears we currently have. I guess it already did use the gears we already have or something. Oh, it's not using the gears we already have. It's weird. Okay, whatever. Uh, yeah. Or what it's doing is it's building up the max number of gears it needs. Then it's going to build other things. How's this doing? Uh, not that. I want to go in there and have a look at how this is doing. I have no idea how I went in here previously. Oh no, zooming in on the map. There we go. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be fine. Hopefully. Hopefully it's going to be fine. Right, so we have more of these. I like the speed up bit here, but on the other hand... There we go. So, get down to the point where we need it. Nice straight line of these. Hmm. Okay, we're out again? Oh, <sighs> my god. So many of these. What I'm hoping basically is that this will make this whole production line a little bit more like it'll, it'll mean that we're using more of all of our ore in general. That's what I'm hoping. Got some of that. Grab all of this that we can. We are severely lowering our. I said severely. We're kind of lowering our uh, science production by doing this. But that's fine. Uh, what are we missing? We're missing more iron gear wheels. Yeah, we just need more of those. Yeah. Okay, we have enough uh, transport bells probably to last a lifetime, I imagine. On right, this side, uh, grab the uh, yeah, grab the gear wheels that we can. Get some more of those. All right, we'll just take the uh, shortcut back down here. All right, over here. This way. And then onto our super speed line all the way down. All right. So this goes all the way down here. Pretty much. Yep. Uh, turn that at the corner. We're out again? Oh no, we have more. Fast transport belts all the way along. Nice. Then we probably want to do fast transport belts here as well. We can. Mm, can't quite. Okay. Need just a few more. We could steal some from this line if we were looking for the quick answer. Which might be the best answer. Yeah. We don't really need them on that line right now. So we'll just do it like that. Okay. Head down here and then... Finish our line. Oh. Finish our line. That's better. So now these are getting split a little bit better. That's good. 
Still not quite enough production to make that a, well no, it's almost enough production to do two lines of that, but that looks a lot better in terms of how our production is going. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So what we want to do is we want to get a bunch of stuff up here now. We're going to get a load of assembly blocks, uh, whatever they're called. They are called assembly machines. And we just need a bunch of the basic level assembly machines and we can then do a whole bunch of that. All right, grab the iron that we can here. Uh, yeah, we'll, bu we'll build all of them. Okay. So let's think about an optimal way of doing this. So, oh, these don't have power? Wow, they really don't have power, huh? Okay, that's better. Okay, right. So, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want this to come around. Basically, I think if we start, well, if we go here, we assume this is going to turn around at that point. Right, and then go a little bit. We then assume that we want to go one away. Basically have this go around a path that then has an inside path as well. Yeah, and then we'll have the inside path go off somewhere. That seems fine. Uh, it's not very scalable, but it's fine. Don't really care about scalability right now. Uh, what did I, oh, I just picked one up again. That's fine. There we go. Do something like... I don't really want to, uh, to uh, um, hide ourselves in too much. I guess that we have to if the way I've done it. That's fine. Uh, so we'll go along the outside here. Yeah, as long as I leave myself enough room that we can go back along. We can always go underground if we need extra room. Uh, let's do some. Let's do something like this. Okay. And then that will end here. Then we'll have another line going along this way. Well, you know what? What would be a better way of doing this? Be to have. Oh, okay, let's get, uh, oh, we're actually out of things we can research. You gotta get this blue science going, don't we? Uh, I need one more line here, I think. Uh, which means this line needs to be moved away slightly. Um, I can build another one of those, that'll probably fix it. Right, and then something like that probably works better. Okay, so now this inside line is going to go, that one's not needed, because that can't do anything, that one's not needed, because that can't do anything, so these can go back down here, that one's not needed, the corner ones really just aren't needed, uh, that's fine, Try to think of a better way of doing this, it would be better if I did it like that, there we go. Is that way I can grab them from that line. If I do the same here as well. Okay. Uh, and then I do that. There we go. That's better. So net. That's just not even. Uh, yeah, let's make these look at least the same. So if I do that, yeah, that's a little bit better. So now I go in here. This is almost definitely not optimal. Ah, there's still no way for that one to touch anything there. I mean, the straight line is really the most optimal, but I'm trying to use space here. I guess we just go with that. That'll probably be our most optimal one. We don't have enough in um, assembly machines that's a problem anyway. Yeah. So we'll go uh, around this way. Uh, then down this way. Then along this way. 
And then it can split up whatever way it needs to down there. This one now goes... Uh, one further. Down here. Yeah. And that's fine. This is going to be where our uh, stuff leaves. And we can then send it off in whatever directions we need to send it off in. Right. So, um, let's get ourselves some power over here. Uh, something like this seems fine to me. Yeah, something like that seems fine to me for power. Then we want inserters. We want to go uh, in... In, in, in. In, in. Uh, like here, in. There we go. Get that around. Perfect. So, something like that, I think. Although, I think we worked out we needed two to be optimal on these or something like that. I seem to remember putting two on the previous, on the other ones. So, we'll do something like that. Well, not optimal, but two to make it work at max efficiency. Yeah, something like this, I think, is what we're going to go with. There we go. Something like that. Uh, and then we'll go one on the other side, I think it was. This one is awful. That's not in the right spot at all. Um, now we have a hole in our thing. You all will just keep it. Right, destroy these as well, because they're not necessary. Uh, something like that on the outside. Probably using way too many of these, but that's fine. Oh yeah, and down here. Something like that. Okay, uh, inserters out again. Are they inserters when they're outputting something? Probably not, they're probably outserters. There we go. Yeah, those in there. Place this up here. Place this one down here. And then we can tell them what we need them to do. So, now we need these things to make us, uh, what's accumulator? Hmm. No, that's not what we're looking for. Uh, we need them to make us iron gears. Let's set them all on iron gear production. There we go. Oh, it's night time, so we put out a light. There we go. Iron gear, iron gear, iron gear, iron gear, iron gear, iron gear, and iron gear. Perfect. So now we've got our iron gear production going. We can now do something like, uh, let's see, let's splitter it at the end. Why is none of that placing onto the in? I thought it would place onto the inner track if it could. Maybe I'm, f no, I, th I was sure it would place onto the, well, does it not, does it just not place onto the inner track? Well, that's, this makes this very inoptimal then. So what we would have to do if it won't place onto the inner track is... I don't know. Guess what we want to do is we want to get rid of this line. And now at least that will place onto the right track. Then we get rid of that line. Get rid of that temporarily. Let's think. I want this to go on the outs. I want this to go on that side, maybe. I want it to twist around like that. There's no way of easily doing that. Is there a way of making this go on the out? Yeah, okay. I think I'll keep this line where it is. So now what we want to do is we want to go along here. Uh, create one underground. That was the wrong one. Make a couple of underground things here. Um, yeah, so let's go. 
Uh, down here. That's incorrect. Uh, get rid of that one. That's probably the easiest way of fixing that problem. Um, we could actually just go down like that. That would probably be fine. Were these not in range? <laughs> Oops. That's fine. Uh, and then this we'll put in on that, that slot. Yeah, it's a little bit better now. Now what we want to do is we want to grab this. And we want to go, hey, this line, it's going on a little journey. Oh. Um, there we go. And we want it to go up here and then probably cross over. So go under. Then we want it to go up this way. And oh, that's one too far. Okay. Then we want it to go under here. Then we want it to go up around under here okay along this way uh up this way now oh, we can keep going along this way up this way oh wait when did how did i get oh i got some coal on there that's fine we'll get rid of that um right along this way now, where do I split up? I actually split off here. So what I want to do is I want to destroy what I got going on over here. So the, the gears are only made here and they get split into two. Yes. So what I can do is I can destroy the gear making facility. That's fine. Get rid of all of this. There we go. Nice. Get rid of this bit. Perfect. Uh, get rid of that. That's all unnecessary now. This can now be a straight line. This has to go underneath. And then go in there. So now our gear production is at full. Although, although, no, this is fine. I do need to change how this is done, however. Because what I want to do is I want to do that. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Right, so now we have gears being produced there, which we can then also use um, for our engines. So now we have a gear production thing for our engines over here. And that's good. We have a, a dedicated gear production facility. We're producing a ton of gears and we pretty much are at max gear production. The problem now is that we don't have any um, red science production or ne or a need. So all of that is wasted in a way. But that's fine. We can we can we can sort this out next time. Thank you for watching. See you then. Goodbye.